the countdown is on. Tomorrow, a rare solar eclipse will cross North America, and millions of us are expected to gaze into the sky. Miana Massey spoke to a professor at Johns Hopkins about what you can expect to see. According to NASA, an estimated 31.6 million people could witness a total solar eclipse on April 8th. While Maryland will only see a portion of the eclipse, local watchers can still expect an impressive celestial event. It is special that it's happening close to home, uh, and it'll be the last one here, um, easily reachable from Baltimore. Uh, for 20 years or so. Kevin Lewis, an assistant professor of planetary physics at Johns Hopkins University, says here at home we'll only get a partial eclipse that blocks 85 to 90 percent of the sun beginning around 2.05 p.m. And you'll see the moon slowly cross the face of the sun over that time and the peak when we'll get to about 90 percent coverage, 89 percent coverage. Uh, be about 3:21 p.m. And if you're planning to gaze upon this historical event, you'll need special glasses to avoid permanent eye damage. Regular sunglasses, even those that are polarized and that offer 100% UV protection, are just not suitable. Definitely don't want to look at the sun even during a total eclipse, even when the moon is fully covering the sun. Um, and you really, if you want to look at the sun, you're going to have to use um, specific eclipse glasses. Baltimore's Enoch Pratt Free Library Branch is offering free solar eclipse viewing glasses, but supply is limited. For more information and a list of viewing events in and around Baltimore, check out our website at WJZ.com. I'm Yana Massey for WJZ.